Hey everybody, welcome back to General So's Chicken. We're down here in South Atlanta. This is definitely hot Atlanta, folks. It's like 93 degrees out and the humidity is up, 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 I'm telling you. But check it out. We're over here at China Express down here and this place looks good, but it's one of those places, as you can see, nowhere to go sit inside. They still have the door up. They're still on full COVID, full COVID over there. You gotta pass your stuff through. You can't even get in the front door. You order right at the front door. You know how I feel about those things. Not the greatest about it, but look at these guys get a 4.0 rating on the on the Google. On the Google, they get 4.0. So let's see what these guys really got. First, let's open this bad boy up. Check it out. Whoa! Look at that presentation, huh? That's a nice presentation. That's the way it should be presented with the broccoli on top. Look at that full load. By the way, this whole meal, eight dollars. Eight dollars. And this is enough to feed a small army. General So's army. General So's. Check these little niblets out. Woo! Look at those egg rolls. You don't just get one. They give you two for eight dollars. Can you believe that? Eight dollars. Let's just dive right in and see what these guys got. Let's cut her open. Let's take the old cutting board we got right out here in front. Let's see if we can do it here. Push her open a little bit. Double barrel ya. Bam! Double barrel. Bam, 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 bam. There we go. It looks pretty good. Let's slam one of these little dunkers down then. Mmm. Yeah. Crispy. Wow. Really good flavor. Even though it's all cabbage, they got a little they got a little something inside. I don't know what it is. Maybe a little shoot, a little vegetable in there. Tastes pretty darn good. Yeah. Tell you what. He's like a 4.0 on the Google. I'm giving that one a 7.8. 7 <laughs> Spring rolls ever, I think. But just dive right in this fried rice. Uh oh. We're gonna question that broccoli though in a second. Now the broccoli's got a little onion in here, I see. But she's fried up. She's fried up good. Let's check her out. Mmm. Mmm. You know, not, it's got a little fla good flavor. A little, a little smoky flavor. Fried rice. <laughs> Gotta keep in my mouth, right? Mm. 6.0. 6.0. This fried rice. Now, let's see. Is this cooked? Is this cooked? It is cooked. It is cooked. It's cooked pretty darn good the way it should be, but no sauce on it. But check this chicken out. Let's check her out and see what we got. Boy, it's a smoker out here today. Woo! It's smoking hot. Eating General Tso's chicken out here. All right, guys, check that baby out right there. Uh, it looks kind of fatty. Looks kind of a scrappily-ish, but some bread in this. Check her out. Uh, you know, put a little fried rice with it. Not bad. Mm. Oh, there's a good piece right here. So not all scrappily. That's a good piece. Put a piece of the broccoli. That's not bad. And look at the load of food you get. I mean, it's just unbelievable. Mmm. Good texture. A little bit of heat. Good flavor. Not overly breaded. Tastes pretty good. It's a little scrappily, but you know what? It's not bad at all. I'll give this rating overall, too, with the chicken and everything else. I'm going to give her a good solid 7.5. Nine, 7.9, mark it down, mark it down. They're not bad at all. Come on down and visit them. China Express, but you gotta stand outside and wait for your food, so you might as well order quick. Go online and check them out. Maybe you can order from there. All right, but you know what we all come for. It's that time, folks, it's that time. Hold on, hold on, 
am Ting. Oh my gosh, it's smoking out here, producer. <laughs> it's a heat wave. We've got a question from a subscriber. Woo, okay, let's get her going. This is from Wayne. Let me pat my brow off here before I'm sweating to death here. This is from Wayne in Salem, West Virginia. Wayne in Salem, West Virginia. What do you got, Wayne? He wants to know in which American region did the chop suey sandwich originate? And what is it made of? Wow, a person that knows about the chop suey sandwich—he must have. He had Wayne must be from Fall River, Mass. Then oh. he's probably not from West Virginia. He's probably from Fall River, Mass. Where guess what? It originated from back in the early 1900s. Now, this is more like like a chop suey sandwich, like a stir fry with vegetables and meat. And what they did is check this out. These guys. They put it on a hamburger butt up in Massachusetts. They put it on a hamburger butt. Next thing you know, they're gonna be asking with cheese on it or not. They put it in a bun and they served it and that's how they ate it. You gotta think that's crazy, but hey, good question, Wayne. I hope that answers your question. Fall River Mass chop suey sandwich is what that baby is. Come down and get it. All right, guys, it's time for what? Fortune cookie time. Fortune cookie time. Whoa, sniff her up. Smells good. Well. Yeah. These crisps, we're doing good so far. Procrastination is the fear of success. Procrastination is the fear of success, but the one thing you can't procrastinate on is what? Like it and subscribe and smashing that like button. Tell your friends and family, become, become, help us get bigger. Become part of the General So's army. That's what we gotta do. Hey, by the way, thanks everybody for liking and subscribing. Everything helps. Please leave the comments below. If you got any questions, make sure you leave it below or you can email me at General So's Chicken Reviews at gmail.com. But you know what we all really come for? Lucky numbers. Lucky numbers. Lucky numbers. Lucky, 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 lucky numbers. Here we go. Here we go. 52, 26, 49, 34, 9, and the magic number 77. 777. We all want to go directly to heaven. Eating general souls every day will get you there. It's liking the subscribe button will definitely get you there. All right. This is my empty promises. Have yourself a great day.